This is our 2018 Tesla Model X. It's the 75D four wheel drive SUV. It is a one owner car from brand new. It's only a couple of years old. So you've got the benefit of the Tesla warranty and service. Sorry, Tesla warranty and battery warranty. The Tesla warranty is four years on these and bat year, battery warranty is eight years. So you've got the balance of those um, to fall back on. Uh, Teslas actually don't need servicing as such because there's no real moving parts to service, uh, which is great. Now this particular car has been enhanced by Kingsbridge. So it's one of our enhanced cars that we've spent uh, a lot of money and time making it look like it does. So it stands out from all the others. Uh, I'll talk you around what we've done. So um, first of all, you've got the, all the chrome has gone. So everything's gone gloss black. We've only left that little touch of chrome on the Tesla uh, lettering at the back just to give it, uh, to make it stand out. And then all the um, Tesla badges are done in satin black. So the 22 inch wheels, which are a 5,000 pound option on Tesla, um, they've all been uh, powder coated in gloss black as well with the black center caps and wheel nut covers. All the brake calipers have been um, painted in gloss red with um, the Tesla logo on them. Now all the tires, uh, this car had uh, mixed tires. I hate mixed tires. I hate it when people put one brand on the front, another brand on the back with completely different treads. And actually, it's not something you should do in a four-wheel drive car because it puts extra strain on the drivetrain. Um, so uh, we've actually replaced all four. So a brand new set uh, of Toyo Proxies, um, premium tires all the way around. As you can see there, they are brand new. Uh, we don't put cheap Chinese ones. We always put a decent uh, premium tire on. Um, all the privacy glass has been extended, so it runs all the way from the back to the front. Obviously, it's lighter at the front to let in more light, as per the law. You've got the carbon fiber wrapped wing mirrors, which look fantastic. Then you've got the tinted smoked PPF to the headlights. That's a paint protection film, but it's actually designed for headlights to protect them from stone chips. And it's got a slight smokiness to it as well to give you the um, completely blacked out look that we've gone for here. Again, the satin black on the badges. And then everything else obviously has been uh, gloss black. So it looks absolutely fantastic in my, in my opinion. I think it looks um, quite different to your standard Model X uh, and just looks that bit more stealth and mean, which uh, actually the previous owner called this car. You'll see when I go inside, he called it the Batmobile. And I think now it does look like the Batmobile. Well, his everyday SUV car anyways. So like I said, it's one owner and um, everything that's there, everything that should be with the car is with the car. And with it being the late 2018, it's got the MC2, which is the later version of the interior screen. So you've got things like karaoke, toy box, etc., that you potentially don't get on the earlier models. Um, you've also got a very, very high spec on this one. First of all, it's got the white premium leather seven seats. Uh, it's got the premium audio system. It's got the, the winter pack with a heated uh, steering wheel and all seven seats heated, as well as the heated washer jets and heated windscreen wipers. You've also got the tow bar uh, to go on the back as well, which is great. So if we pull, if we open the rear, the rear boot area, you can see here the three rows of seats all finished in the premium white leather. And what you get with the, um, the premium interior pack that you have to pay for is the Alcantara headliner rather than the standard fabric. So there's a lot of Teslas out there. We just have fabric seats. They even have the, um, the vegetarian leather. And then the ones, uh, there are some that don't have the premium, of course, which is what this has got. And if they've got a standard fabric roof, that's because they haven't got the premium pack. Underneath here, you've got the Tesla uh, boot space and the Tesla um, wire mesh uh, load space cover. Loads of space under there. 
and then obviously when you put these seats down as well um, there's a huge boot to, to benefit from and these seats literally just go down like this and you can fold them down you can also do it electronically uh, I believe from the front screen there's a 12 volt socket just there as well press the button and that will go down moving on to the fantastic gullwing doors so again because it's got the premium you've got the alcantara headliner which is fantastic this one's got the optional carbon fiber pack um, this is this guy basically just ticked every option it's got the enhanced autopilot with auto summon uh, it's got everything every option that there was this car's got so you've got the carbon fiber you've got the leather um, white leather to the door uh, the additional speakers can i just say the sound system on the premium sound system in tesla is phenomenal better than pretty much every sound system i've heard on any other car it is fantastic it's that good it may not have a fancy name like burmester or bose but it is absolutely much better and you, trust me when you get in it if you've never heard it before you'll be like wow this is amazing now you've got the additional controls there to close or open the doors for the rear passengers you can see there you've got the carbon and then again on there white leather and carbon it just looks superb uh, now this car was used uh, by the previous owner as a chauffeur car so essentially he was chauffeured by a chauffeur in it around central london um, obviously no emissions etc um, with it being all electric um, and this car's perfect for that sort of thing it's perfect for around town just everyday driving you can get 200 miles to, of, of range um, we had a model x that uh, i went up with a family into uh, glen eagles in scotland a few months ago um, between lockdowns and um, we went and I think we stopped off twice at the Tesla supercharger which is great they, they charge the car really quickly um, and uh, you know you don't need 100d or uh, the longer range one 75d is perfectly adequate and you'll whatever car you have you'll need to stop off at some point for um, you know a little break and you just plug it into the supercharger and, and away you go it's it's great it's really really quick and then looking on your app, the app will tell you when the car's charged and you can just then pop out. So you download the app, you can open the car, lock the car, set the climate, um, see where it is. It's great. Once you've registered the car to yourself, you can do everything from the Tesla app. You can book a service, etc. You've got this fantastic heated uh, and electric seats with memory. Um, you've got the carbon fiber, you've got the leather top to the dash. So again, that's part of the premium interior pack. Obviously, you've got that fantastic glass panoramic roof that goes all the way up. Glove box here with a Tesla book in it. And if we open the front trunk, which I'll show you in there as well. So in here you've got the charging cable, uh, you've got the Tesla tow bar pack, so that will give you a tow bar and all the required fittings for it to just pop in underneath. Uh, so you can put a cycle rack or tow a trailer, Tesla emergency kit, etc. So if we go to the doors now these open automatically when you've got the key in your pocket as well and then they close automatically you just put your foot on the brake and the door closes again there you can see the carbon fiber the white leather it's fantastic really really the best spec tesla model x you can buy on the market because it's got every single option so there you can see as soon as i got in the door just closes and then you can of course just press close all and then all the doors will close There you go. And then you can also do the reverse of that. You can click open all, um, driver passenger. You can also adjust the height, etc., etc. Uh, loads of other things you can do. So, for example, you're charging. You can set how much you want it to charge. So, for every day, it's not usually around 80%. Um, you can set it for longer journeys uh, to the maximum. Uh, you can open the charging port by just pressing that button or pressing on it there. Um, you can also set uh, restore. So, this will, if you set your 
um, name to the car once you've downloaded the app and program the seat and mirrors and everything how you like it you simply click on that click on your name and it will adjust the seat and everything to those settings um, you've also got home link on this one so you can actually program your gate or garage to open and close uh, from the car uh, you've got obviously Bluetooth as you can see there um, you see that the previous owners called it Batmobile um, which I think like I say now it certainly does look like the Batmobile pretty cool you can obviously change that name if you don't like it <laughs> you don't have to have that um, great range of music so you can obviously play uh, radio you've got internet radio um, in the in the form of tuning and then you've also got uh, you can see they can listen to podcasts if you want uh, if you just want to have some light listening and um, have some books read to you or people's own podcasts it's, it's great stuff um, you've also got of course karaoke so if you want to do a bit of karaoke with the kids or family you can select that uh, which is unique to the MC2 to the, to the later 68 plates because this is the end of 2018 registered car uh, Spotify so you can obviously play uh, whatever song you want pretty much so you can have a little game with the kids and right you pick a song now your turn and you'll choose songs to play um, which is great you've got uh, your phone you can use to play music from and of course the radio as I mentioned already it's great and then you can search for literally any song you can also do it by voice control with a voice button here as it's showing you on there so you can literally say a song and it'll find it for you it's great um, you've also got here if you click this button here you can go to toy box so you can do things like um, the whoopee cushion uh, joke you've got the uh, romance setting well put a fireplace on and play music and turn the heating on sketch pad to mess about on uh, for the kids again if you're out of the car or you fancy it There's loads of different things you can play about with you can make the car uh, feel like it's um, a James Bond Lotus submarine um, it's great. It's so, it's so uh, innovative what they've done, uh, and and so entertain so entertaining entertainment. You've got all these games as well you can play on the main screen. It's brilliant. Um, web, of course, you can just use the car like a normal computer and just access the internet. Go to Google, and um, you know search for whatever you want, BBC, etc., etc. So you know you don't need to uh, a computer almost. You've got essentially a computer here. So the car's now just gone to to Tesla website. cross that out um, that's it's pro what it's programmed to do by default um, charging I've already discussed with you I've shown you that uh, and obviously the energy button you can see uh, what your projected range is how much energy you're using etc um, cameras so you've got the reversing camera and you've also got on this again because it's the later model let's just go through calendar and uh, cool etc oh well, let me just show you before I go to what I was going to say about the dash cams so the winter pack that gives you all the seats heated and the steering wheel and the screen and you've also got uh, heated wipers uh, and washers which are great let's just tick all off so it all goes off um, so if we go to the main menu here yeah so with the uh, camera you've actually also got uh, let's see is it here safety and security there we go so yeah with a sentry mode um, sorry not the sentry mode, with the dash cam here you go so on the later models it's actually got dash cam so all the cameras around the car will automatically record any activity around the vehicle and then you can play that back later you don't need a separate dash cam it's built in to the car already um, you can set the alarms you can, I mean there's so much you can do on here mobile access allow keyless driving if needs be um, there's just loads of different things there that's great currently done 25,000 miles or thereabouts uh, autopilot has got the full enhanced autopilot so once you once you've got this you can um, you can use the app to summon the car in and out of a parking space you can navigate an autopilot so the car will um, navigate and actually when it approaches traffic lights and junctions it will stop slow down etc um, it will also steer out of uh, a lane to on the, on, the, on the exit to a junction um, now the car won't actually drive itself because it's not allowed in UK law um, but once you've got this system 
when uh, it is allowed you'll be able to just download it and um, without paying any further monies blind spot collision automatic emergency braking etc etc it's got everything on the full enhanced autopilot which was like a five gram package uh, you've got of course your acceleration regenerator of braking and steering mode you can adjust your lights um, suspension you can obviously adjust the height etc quick fold there there's loads you can play with and then of course you've got uh electric steering column here you've got uh, the adaptive cruise control here um you've got the power folding wing mirrors you've got the main screen here which you can then uh you know play about with that here you've got the voice control as well you can display uh, various different things there we've got two keys of course in here we've got the uh, adapters so if you've got a it's quite annoying on normal cars if you've got a big bottle you can't fit it in on these ones you can just adjust them um, and there's another set here as well a lot of car, a lot of Teslas these are missing this hasn't been messed about with so they are in place you've also got the uh, the wireless charging etc you've got the uh, USB sockets of course everything's covered in carbon because it's got the optional carbon pack You've got your uh, sun visors here, so they just pop out magnetically, and then you can open them up and open again. And then you've got the um, rear view, uh, sorry, vanity mirror. And you can just push that there. That's great. So that's how the sun visors work. And that is pretty much it, guys. That is my tour on the Model X. It's a lovely, lovely car in great condition and i think they are fantastic um well well worth uh having as an electric car as an everyday car i think they do everything very well they're big they're comfortable uh, they've got loads of technology um, it just makes a lot of sense uh, in terms of a, an electric car probably one of the best on the road i'd say um that's it guys that's our tesla model x um, if you would like any further information, by all means, um, give me a call, drop me a text or email. We'll be more than happy to help. Uh, other than that, if you would like quotes on finance or you'd like delivery to your door, we can arrange that for you, no problem. Part exchange, of course, no issue. Uh, happy to help in any way we can. Please look at our five-star reviews um, to give you complete peace of mind when buying from Kingsbridge. Uh, and that's it. Thank you very much for watching. Please subscribe to our YouTube channel and we'll see you on the next video. Have a good night.